So, <laughs> a person who's six feet tall. <laughs> person who's six feet tall is casting a shadow 2.4 feet long. At the same time of day, a building casts a shadow of 32 feet. How tall is the building? And here's the thing, it's all about proportions. Because if I were to draw this, and you can actually draw it like a triangle, because that's really what's going on. So suppose we have something like this, and this is probably going to be very far from accurate, but it doesn't really matter. If this is your building over here, and here is the length of his shadow. Are you with me on that picture? Oh, I'm sorry, here, let me do this. Here's the doors and... Of course, all the windows have to look like that, right? Maybe he's got a little chimney up here because after all, that's what all buildings have. So anyway, there's your building. Now, with a triangle, no matter where you are, if you draw something like this, it's going to be proportional. We talked about, if you remember geometry, hopefully you remember similar triangles. That means that the height to the length is going to be in proportion to the height to the length. So we could do this. We can say the height of the object to the length of the shadow. That's the framework that we're going to be using here. Because think about this. If you were outside on a sunny day, the taller the object is, the longer its shadow is, right? So, that's proportions. So, let's look at it this way. Do we know something about the height of an object? What do we know? Six feet tall, Six feet tall measures how long? 2.4 feet for the shadow, right? So the height to the length. So what's the height of the building? Ooh, is it X or is it 32? Oh, sorry, guys. It's unknown because it says, how tall is the building? I don't know how tall it is, but I do know that the length of the shadow is what? I do know that that's 32. Now look at this. That shadow is considerably longer than the shadow of the man or person. It doesn't say man, the person. Okay. So I would expect that the height of the building would be a lot taller than the height of the person, right? So what are we going to do from here? That sounds great, whoever did not say that, which was everybody. The cross products are going to be equal. So that means 2.4x is going to equal 6 times 32, right? So 2.4x is equal to, how much is that? 192, bless you. And when I do the math here, so 192 divided by 2.4, I get 80. So show the work, we divide by 2.4, x is equal to 80. Now does that make sense with what we were talking about before? We said the height of the, op the, height of the building should be a lot taller than the height of the person, right? So we're saying that here is, here's Stick Boy right here. He's six feet tall. We're saying the building is 80 feet tall. Of course, my diagram is so off, it's not even funny. Okay, you know what? Fine, fine. Disclaimer. Not to scale. Are you, is that better now? So how tall is the building? The building is what? Yeah. 
the building is 80 feet tall.